do you kind of keep your spirits up uh, going through this, this time where you guys are obviously mm-hmm. you're struggling with big on a bowl like that out there? Uh, you know, just knowing, you know, we're coming out there and giving it our all. And, um, you know, last game we felt like we didn't do that. And, uh, you know, this this game, you know, I feel like we did a better job. But, you know, we could definitely be better. But, um, yeah, it's tough. It's tough keeping our spirits up. But, um, you know, with us being young, we just, you know, just got to come out there and fight. And, um, you know, I think, I think, I think, you know, that's, that's, that's just our biggest objective so far. What made it so difficult for you guys to score and get kind of shots that you wanted against the Jazz, especially in yeah. the first three quarters? Well, obviously, you know they're a great, they're a great defensive team. Um, you know, probably the best shot blocker in the league down there. And uh, you know, a lot of a lot of guys, you know, they play a lot of principal defense, Bogdanovich, and um, you know, guys like that. But you know, I think we went in a little slump, you know, to where we couldn't score, and um, you know, we sort of let that affect our defense. And uh, you know, I feel like fourth quarter, you know, even though the score was, even though the score was crazy, I feel like we um, we got a little momentum. Offensively and defensively, so um, I think we outscored them like 36 to 24 in the fourth quarter. So, yeah. I imagine obviously you know you're not you're not happy with the season, but right. in some respects I figure that I mean you're a young player, you this is a chance to to get out there and play. I right. imagine that you still feel like you may be accomplishing something by being out there and getting those reps in. Oh uh, yeah, no doubt. Um, like you said, man, we're young. A lot of you know a lot of guys that we have out there are young right now. So we're just trying to take advantage of the opportunity. And uh, you know I. I I speak for myself and I know a lot of my teammates, you know, we're just trying to take advantage of the opportunity and, um, you know, just go from there. Aaron Ventures on Zoom, go ahead. How are you processing trying to learn from these games? You guys are playing some pretty good teams and some good veteran players that you can learn from going up against them. Are you able to process that as opposed to being impacted by the league? Uh, yeah, it's definitely a lot of things we're learning from. Um, you know, other than other than the loss, uh, you know, just watching film, uh, you know, certain defensive things, certain offensive things, you know, that'll help us, you know, for the rest of this year and, you know, next year. Um, you know, just trying to get better and um, just go from there. And how about the fact that you just played four in a row, you come home for one and go back one of those for five. Is that in a way, I mean, obviously that's a lot of trouble, but for a young team, does it bring you guys closer together? Uh yeah, uh you know like like we man we've been on the road. I think this is our ninth day on the road. Um, go back home for a few days, then right back on another nine day trip. And uh, yeah, man, it definitely brings us closer. Uh, you know a lot of a lot of the young guys we're we're always together, um, texting each other in each other's rooms or whatever. So just building that chemistry on off the court, and um, you know just trying to make improvements on the court. Great game for you. Uh, what did you learn in that six, six game stretch for your team and for your game as well? Say, what did I learn? What did you learn in the last six game stretch? Uh, man, you know, just just certain certain things defensively. Um, we got to get better at. Um, you know, like I said, the last game, the second game versus Minnesota, we felt like we didn't come out there and give it our all. And um, you know, other you know, regardless of what the score is, you know, that's that's coach that's coach Bill's message to us is just go out there and give it our all. And uh, you know, live with the results. And I think you know that's that, that's that's what we're trying to learn, and that's what we're trying to do. And uh, you know, just go out there and leave it all on the floor. And uh, you know, I think we did a better job of that tonight, and uh, we can keep getting better. And for you personally, how important is your game with the energy, with the great the attitude and great the vibe in the team? How important is to bring the energy on floor on both ends? How important is it to bring energy on both ends of the floor? Yeah, uh, you know, personally, man, I feel like, uh, you know, that's one of my one of my biggest things that one of, you know, my job to do is, is bring that energy, uh, you know, bring that good vibe to the team, that, that spirit, you know, that I've been doing all season. And, um, you know, regardless of the score, you know, I, mean, I just try to keep my teammates' heads up and uh, keep pushing and keep going. And, um, you know, it's better days to come. And, you know, we're going to keep getting better and uh, keep improving.